Hey guys, so here's the ingredients for the chicken lo mein. I have carrots, I have bell peppers, yellow, red, and orange. Feel free to use a green pepper, whatever you'd like. I have garlic, I have onions, I have chicken, and I have my seasonings. There's um, five spice, soy sauce, ginger, hoisin, and that is um, sesame oil. And I have good old spaghetti. You can use any kind of noodles you want. Okay, so, and I have also soy, um, uh, duck sauce, because I ran out of the duck sauce that I keep in the fridge. So I had, of course, Chinese packets that I'm gonna add to it. Okay, so this is all your ingredients. I do it to the amount of, um, I make the amount that my family's gonna eat. I'm making about a pound and a quarter of spaghetti. So um, I have like maybe two bell, maybe a bell, um, a pepper and a half, maybe one carrot, one and a half carrot, maybe two small onions, and like three chicken breasts, and then a couple of tablespoons of garlic. It depends on how much garlic you want. And that stuff there, I just kind of throw in myself to taste. Okay, if you do want specific um, recipe, if you do want specific um, amounts, let me know, and I and I can give you that. Okay. See ya in a few. So here we are, guys. I have the peppers, onions, and carrots, and garlic all cooking. Now what I'm gonna do is just cook them for a couple of minutes. I'm gonna wait like another minute to like get a little bit softer, and then I'm gonna put all the seasonings in it, okay? Um, I'm also, I forgot to tell you, I'm gonna put a little salt, not a lot, because there's gonna be soy sauce in it, and pepper and garlic powder and onion powder. Okay, I have the water boiling here for the, almost boiling, for the pasta, okay, for the noodles. And once that's done, I'm going to put it all together. But what I'm waiting for is this to get a little bit more cooked, and then I'm going to throw the seasonings in, and then I'm going to throw the chicken in and let that all cook together. All right? And um, then I'll show you the, the whole product at the end. Okay. Hey guys, so I'm gonna be finishing the chicken lo mein now. Okay, all the chicken and everything is all done. See, it's all done now. You can add a little bit of water to this if you think it's a little bit too thick, but it's usually a very good consistency. Again, I'm gonna try my best to put all the ingredients in the description below. This way you guys know. I mean, I kind of do it by eye and just by taste and stuff, but if you don't feel comfortable with that, then I then you know, you can use the, the exact measure, um, the exact amount um, if you want. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna add the pasta, okay? Now, like I said, you can, you can make any type of noodles you want, okay? And also, you can put, you can substitute beef, beef lo mein or, or beef and chicken or chicken and shrimp or just shrimp, you know, any kind of other vegetables you want, scallions, maybe, um, I don't know, any any other kind of vegetables you, you like, maybe cabbage, you know, it'd be delicious in this, mushrooms. All right, now I'm trying to figure out how much, I have about a pound and a half here. We're big eaters over here, so. All right, I think that should be enough. You can always add more if you need it. Now, the important thing is to get it all incorporated. I hope you guys can see me over here. I wonder if this light is just, maybe that the light is better or no. All right, let's see. I think the light's better. All right, so what I'm gonna do is, there's a little bit of a glare. I hope you guys can see this. I'm gonna mix it all together. All right, coat it good. And you know, after you, after you mix it all together, taste it. If it, you think it needs a little bit more soy sauce or you know, a little bit more five spice, then, um, you know, just add it to it. it. It's fine. You can do whatever you want. As long as, you know, it tastes good to you, that's all there is, you know, that, that's, that's all that matters. Now, this is coating very well. Some people like it a little bit juicier. You can even add a little chicken broth if you want, if you feel like it's too dry. You know, anything you want. That's the, the great thing about this meal, that you can do anything you want. And it's really, really quick. It's a quick meal. Look at this. I bet you now that if you went in your in your refrigerator in your pantry, you probably have all the stuff to make this. It literally can take a half hour between just boiling the pasta, 
you know, and cutting up the meat. And the sh like I said, you can put shrimp in it, anything. It's really, really good, guys. All right? So this is it. Chicken lo mein. This is what's for dinner tonight. All right? I hope you guys try it. And, ooh, sorry, I'm trying to finagle this video camera a little bit. Um, so listen, hit the subscribe button on the bottom and hit the like button if you like, if you like this video and, um, make sure you tune in and I'll be back, um, in a day or two with, with another cooking video. Okay. Have a great night.